Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy IX Blind. In the last episode, I left you guys off here while I basically tried to solve the puzzle of the maze room. And I think uh, I actually going to add a little bit more on to that. Who knows how, how things will go. I don't think I will just have those two rooms. Try me trying to solve those two rooms in the last episode because I don't know. I will just record and see how things go from from there. Anyway, oh, how have you been, guys? Been doing? I've been bored, basically. That's what I've been doing. I've been bored. Yay! Because life is kind of boring sometimes, you know. Not that I not that I complain. I mean, I have a pretty easy life. Nothing I can comp really complain about. Just. Sometimes life can be a challenge. Uh, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Really? Really just li life is pretty easy for me, so... I can't complain. Actually, now that I have, uh, I have like, yeah, I have sword magic, right? It's one sword magic I don't have, and uh, one, two, three, four, four sword attacks I don't have. Well, let's try Firaga. but it should be that right now. I basically also switched out all my party members because in the last episode we had nothing but uh, you know those four party members so now I'm like I have these four party members now but I'm not switching out to, uh, to, to Claire. Do you still want to go on? Sure we'll head into danger. There's the observatory you told me you become my angel of death. But think for a moment, isn't life death itself? It must kill other life forms to survive. Sometimes it even kills those with human shares of blood. To life is to give life's meaning, yet one must take others life to survive. A mature civilization becomes aware of this paradox. Terror souls will sleep until they forget such nonsense. They will begin a new life in a new dimension. It is a world in which life and death become one. This is the dimension in which we are meant to live, as being that present life and death. Sudan, I ask you one more time. Who are you? You are a sad man, Garland. We know more than you. We're not perfect, but we have friends who help us. That is reason enough for us to live. We live to protect the ones we love. And I may not know who I really am, but the question alone is the end. It took us a long time, but we f all found our way. Then show me. Lecture me again when you are at the verge of death. Here we go. Uh, steel. Um, you're doing shock life. What does this do? Knocks out the target. Reduces the attack power. Uh, reduces magic defense. Uh, it's a power break. See what that does. And you, yeah. you can use Karaga on everyone. Let's see if it works on this one. Nope, doesn't work. You steal again. Uh, 
it's the dark side. Cure everyone there for me, Eco, will you? Maybe I should um, cast something. Is that magic that it uses? Because otherwise, I can use this. Let's see if that helps. Um, does it still have anything? Ah, I blocked. I'll see. Drop poison bio. Um, that's a bio. Let's see if it still has anything for me to steal. Carries Kaiser Knuckles. Okay, so it does it does still have anything, something for me to heal, or to steal. Sorry. Uh, well, that worked. Let's see. No, I couldn't steal anything? Um, let's reflect. Oh, let's see. Everyone okay? That's uh, fine, let's just heal yourself. Let's try and steal again. You, um... Just deck. Oh, so now you're doing physical attacks, eh? Well, just do Fira. Uh, let's see, attack. You steal. To wait for the. Uh... Oh, okay, it's dead. Well, that was kind of. I didn't get the uh, the Kazar knuckles, whatever those were. But hey, that was kind of easier than I expected it to be. We learned Thunder Slash and Auto Life. We got a Wing Edge. Colin, tell me, what is it that you want to accomplish? The restoration of Terra. Is, isn't it obvious? No, that's what the people of Terra want. Why aren't you asleep with the rest of them? I was created to oversee Terra. I exist to wait for a time when this world is without life or death. I am the absolute controller of this planet. Are you now? I didn't expect you to fight me though. Like you were like, I'm very calm. I am very collected. I am Colin. What are you doing? Nothing? Okay. Huh. Let's see. Flare, water, comet. Let's try comet. Ew, steel. Everyone is pretty uh, OP except for uh, Quina. Um, yeah, let's uh, do reflect again. Oh, you're a Mew, eh? Well, that's fine, that's fine. Not like, um... That, Petrify, Petrify probably will... That will probably won't work. Uh... Whatever, Bio. Apparently, PB even can do like osmosis. 
Huh. Well, wave doesn't seem to work on uh, on that, so. So you couldn't steal anything, eh? Well, here we go. I'm just gonna try and keep the steel. I mean, he doesn't seem that much of a threat. Yeah, have a, have a thunder. Hey, we stole a ninja gear. Um, let's try our high potion on it. Tail effects wa 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 wears off. Uh, attack, steal. You missed! Ha! Huh? You missed me! Sir! You're being very underwhelming to be a, to be to be frank. Oh, okay, I stole everything from him. Okay. He doesn't have anything. Well, that's a message I don't get very often. Okay, now now we can start to heal. Um Really, I don't really need anything. Um Fenrir for Phoenix, Dean, now let's call this Phoenix. What a harm can it really do? You, uh, you. Now we can go all out on you because you no longer have anything. So now I can basically kill you because you're very underwhelming, sir. I expected more from this guy, to be quite frank. Um, let's try osmosis. Let's try if I can uh, heal some. Uh, MP back. Probably won't work, but whatever. You're doing stop? It really won't work. But um, I can cast that stop back at you if you want. Not that not that it's going to do anything, but I can still try. Because you you guard you guard stop or whatever. In the end, it doesn't even matter, because you, sir, are weak. And I am strong. Nope, that didn't work. <laughs> well, <laughs> at least I tried. Yeah. You know what they say, right? If you don't try anything, you will accomplish nothing. Break, uh, sure comment. Oh, you're doing flare. I have that move. Using it against all of us? No, just Diner. That's fine, sir. Diner, you're gonna die right now. Yep, called it. But it doesn't matter, Steiner. In the end, it doesn't even matter whether you die or not, because I can revive you very easily. Oh, you missed? Oh well. Uh, maybe you should do something else then, Vivi, if you, if you missed that attack. Are you doing flare again? No, you didn't wave. But you missed, okay, so... There we go. Here's some uh, fire magic for you. And you're dead, okay. Well, I survived. I revived uh, Steiner just in time then, in that case. I would have healed him otherwise, but you know what? Garland is already dead. You fight well. 
Give it up, Garland. Huh? What the? What is going on? <laughs> this is too easy. The Invincible is mine. Now I have the power to control all souls. Garland gave me everything without a fight. The old fool was too busy dealing with him. Now only death awaits him. Poor Garland, but bitten by his own dog. This is no accident. Fate has chosen me to become the new ruler of Terra. Time for me to put on the finishing touches. Hello, Kuja. I must say, I truly love you all. You not only broke the seal to terror, but you did me the favor of defeating Garland. Zidane, you truly are an extraordinary genome, deserving of my love. What are you doing here, Kuja? That's not a very nice to meet your creature brother. Shut up, you're not a brother of mine. Oh, such ferocity. Oh, Master Garland, he intends to fight Terra. Kuja, what are you scheming? Scheming? Me? Watch me as I defeat these enemies of Terra. Come on now, you may sleep alongside the souls of Terra. For all eternity! Really, Kuja? You're expecting it to go down like that? Let's go, Kucha. I really have no patience for you. Oh, you're doing Tunaga again, eh? You know what? I have the perfect thing for you, sir. Um, Firaga. Let's try this. No, you got it against that? Well, that's fine. Really, it's not, not my concern. Yeah. Dark Strike. Come on, do it again. That's exactly what I was waiting for for you to do. Um, Carbuncle, go. Wait, what? Come on! He was laughing. It's like, there's nothing he can do. Couldn't steal anything. Uh, let's try one on the cell, on Vivi. This time, sir. There's nothing really you can do. Uh. Yes, yes, I will try regardless.
Oh, Zidane, you're dead. Okay, well. It really doesn't matter in the end. So you do have an attack that can just kill kill me instantly. You know what? Yes, I do call that an attack. What do you have? Sir. Oh, you got a fast star attack again, eh? Well, it's this time I'm gonna die. No, I'm not dead yet. You just steal. As long as we keep alive, I can basically just do it. I can just keep on doing it. Wait, what? Fine. Here, life. You attack, you. Um, Comet. You really think you can beat me, sir? It's really nothing you can do to to beat me. Show you, show me your my true power. Okay, I will. If that's really, but truly, what you want. But to be honest, I'm more interested in uh, stealing from you. And that is what I will keep on doing until you have nothing left. As for my true power, sir, you have not even seen my true power yet. I've been going easy on you. Because you are a joke. Get it, Kuja? You're a joke to me. In fact, why don't I show you how much of a joke you are, truly are? By beating you, beating the hell out of you. If this is the best you can do, then truly, this isn't your best day. Hmm. Well, Zidane, I'm just gonna try and keep in stealing with you, but seeing as I have a, a party that's uh, pretty much, uh, I, don't, I don't really need. Well, just do it. You, dark side, you steal. That did a hell of a lot of damage. But uh, yeah, but it also costs like a lot of it. MP. But you know what, Kuja? You're pretty much a joke to me at this point. If this is all you can do, if this is all the strength you can muster, then sorry, but you're you're a joke. In fact, it won't take long to kill you. Oh, you're already dead. In fact. Time is now. Huh. The power of trance! So he has a transform as well, eh? Hmm. Well, that's fine. I'll show you my true power. Ultima!
Come on, show me your true power. Unless you kill me right now. Oh, you did. You did kill me. Well, whatever. That is probably a scripted sequence. Yes. This is the power I've longed for. The mighty power of souls. They assaulted any threat that tries to destroy them. What, what do you mean? It's trance. You know how it works. But a normal trance won't be enough to defeat you. You're all as resilient as Zorkalops. Even tiny Moogles possess the power of trance. When I saw that in Gulag Volcano, I came up with a plan. It was easy. I just needed to borrow the power up from wretched souls that can't die. What had I acquired it? It was the Invincible, or should I say the large eyeball in the sky. The ship sucked up the souls of Mad and Sari, the Aoife Tree, Alexandria to feed upon them. When it fought Behemoth at the Aoife Tree, the Invincible drew in a powerful spirit. Can you guess to whom it belonged? Queen Bronsol, the soul of your mother. The souls trapped inside the Invincible welcomed me with the open arms. They were fed on being, with a bit, they were fed up with being your prisoner, Garland. So, Master Garland, you are no longer needed, and after you worked so hard, I shall rule Terra and Gaia with my unconditional love from now on. What will you do with such power? Master Garland, you of all people should accept defeat gracefully. How sad. Any last words? Your power is meaningless. Ah! Now, it is your turn. Should I kill you quickly to show my appreciation for all you've done? Or should I kill you slowly and painfully to show you my love? Ah, oh, I've got a great idea. How's this? I'll make you pillars for my castle. You all decorate my castle as a symbol of my internal kingdom. How'd you like that? No, never. You could never build an eternal kingdom. That voice. Garland? Did you leave something behind? Do you think a detect defect like you could last forever? What? What do you mean? I built you to last only until worthy genome Sudan grew. It was too dangerous to let you last any longer than that. What are you saying? There's a limit on your life. You will be dead soon. Even as I die, you'll have to you all have died without ever leaving your mark on the world. <laughs> what an interesting lie. You're telling me that my life will end soon. <laughs> Nice try, Garland, but that I won't fall for your silly tricks. Garland? Garland, answer me! You were created to destroy. You are a mortal. A mortal? I'm finished? I, I don't believe you! Why would I believe such a silly story? You're telling me that I'll die soon? That I'm no more powerful than anyone? I'm gonna... die? Lose my... soul? <laughs> what comedy! Sudan isn't hilarious. 
I'll die just like the black mages I so despise. I single-handedly brought chaos onto Gaia, but in the end I'm nothing but a worthless doll. Could you? I won't let it happen. I won't. I won't let the world exist without me. You're destroying terror. I can't believe him. Saddam, so you must escape before the tower collapses. But how? We need to carry the injured out here too. We need to seize the chip Kuja mentioned, the invincible. It's stocked at the bottom of the tower. Oh yeah, but... Alright, you gotta head for the ship. I'm gonna rescue the genomes. They're victims. I can't just abandon them. I'm coming with you. Claire, I want you I don't want you to leave us again. So I'll keep watch over you. Okay, we should be able to get back through the warp gate on the other top. Claire and I will head back to Brown Ball. You guys go get us get us to you on the invincible. In the next episode of Final Fantasy IX Blind, me and Claire are going towards uh, wherever this is, you know, back to Brown Ball in order to rescue everyone that is on there. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Until then, goodbye.